Hey guys, what is up? I am Double Driven. This is week four of the uh, tournament of Rivia. Throwing a Rivia tournament, uh, and as you can see, I'm playing a shizzle. Um, I banned her Skellige list. She's an extremely great Skellige player. Um, always in like the very, very top. Uh, she banned my Skoyatel, unfortunately, my favorite list. So I decided to bring for the game one, I bring Deathwish, and I don't draw a single Deathwish unit. <laughs> uh, sad times in, in Deathwish land. It, uh, this game was rough, as, as you could see from the hand. If you don't have, and I lose the flip, <laughs> I'm just like, what do, I don't have anything to play here. I'm like, well, I could play the sheet troll and uh, eat a, um, a Dow. I'm like, okay, well, I can get, I can get one out with a, uh, Slyzard. I didn't have, the sound was super messed up on this. I don't know what happened with it. But, um, so turn one definitely could have been better, but it is what it is. She goes Stennis into armor. One down. So I wanted to at least get my foglets out. I know it's not the greatest of plays here, but my hand's already bricked pretty bad. I'm thinking, well, I can eat the two wolves because this list does have harpies in it. I do got Striga. So I don't want that to keep going. So we Striga it down. Next turn, she'll start losing some armor. Their strength, the armor is going to come off. She has another one, though. So, I believe I lock it. I'm pretty sure I lock it. Yeah. So I lock it. I'm thinking, well, he could... She could use the uh, rat of it if she wants to. I'm not going to play any of my Death Wish units right now. Probably a mistake using the lock so early. Trollolo comes down. So I figured I'll eat the eat the two wolves, get the harpies out. Pretty big swing. Currently, though, I only have one Death Wish unit in the graveyard. So I figured here, get the foglet out. That way my hand's not bricked. I 
And if death mold's there, then it's there. I mean, there's nothing I could do. So that's where the pass came through. Still hoping for some death wish units. I get Siri Nova. I probably should have just dropped Osril. But I dropped the Cyclops, I think. So I have double slice <laughs> no death wish. I have two Arachospores and a Dow. And I also have uh, the Marloon. I have no way to push. Like, I need I needed death wish units. And she still has Radovid, which sucks. So even if I do get Death Wish units out, I'm in big trouble. We get one of the big armor units out. Still no Death Wish unit. I'm like, you gotta be kidding me. Still no death wish unit. <laughs> I have one in the graveyard. One. Turn one, 20 point play. I'm like, well. I'll just play my Slyzard. I had, I just, this was just brutal. I mean, I got through my deck, but I didn't have the cards that I needed. So I said, well, I could just eat that. It it was it was just brutal this game. I just I did not get what I needed to. I mean I'm using a Cyclops to kill a Dow. So she's still up by 13. Ends up healing. So I'm like, well, it's now or never. I'm going to either get these... Get my one Dow out. So I get it out. Only one. <laughs> Only one. And it gets killed. And I just give up. <laughs> There's nothing else I could do. I mean, I'm... Siri, Siri Nova doesn't even get me up. So I'm down 0-1. I was telling her good game. So on and on these rules, like I said, you have to keep your deck and I have to change. I went with great swords. I do okay with great swords. Problem is, is she knows this list. Like she knows how to play Skellige, so She knows what to go after. I dropped the uh, the Freya 
And I believe I dropped reconnaissance. We win the flip, which is a good thing. So eight points. I got coral, which is nice too. So I play the great sword. Thinking to myself, well, if I can get the engine running, maybe he'll just or she'll just uh, lock it up. Crack pulls uh, old geared on this, so if I'm able to keep the carryover, it's nice. I got Royal Decree for Wild Boar of the Sea. This is a really good turn here. 25 points and draw a card. It's like, that's really good. So I'm thinking, well, I could Wild Boar. I'm checking it out. Because it's going to get buffed up, you know. I'm thinking, well, this is where the, the rat of it comes down. if not a heavy cavalry. The longer this round goes, the better it is for me. Spy comes down. I'm either down a card or... It's just all bad right here. The spy was pretty brutal. I figured I'd let this one get strengthened. Yeah, if Radovid was coming down, it was coming down now. But now I could pull, uh, I could pull Old Geared with him. Or I could just play a boat. I think I go with the boat. So I can get that extra tick out of it. But I go with the crack for the carryover. Since Radovid got used. Just still got some big bombs. I mean, that uh, 
that 11 back there can get buffed up. And the, the thing's going to take the armor. She needs something that's uh, 12 points. That does it. We got the carryover, though, which is good. Hoping for no, like, margarita or anything like that. Figured I'd drop the reconnaissance, I think. Just hoping for like the runestone. Or Freya. Freya's good. I can res a boat. I figured if that's going to sit and run, I should I should coral it. That can get like super out of hand. Just checking to see how many she used. She only used one. I let it roll though. I let it I let it pick up steam. Trying to get an engine going. With the Radovid gone though, it was it was nice to be able to get a little bit of the machine rolling. Now that was scary right there. I'm like, oh my goodness. Another one. I'm like, oh boy. like what do I take out here I mean there's so many things that uh, I mean Trollolo you got the Redanian Knight the Elite I'm like ugh so I'm like well let's just play double ships I think I play double ships. So she passes right here, it's uh it's gonna tick over. Big play here, fifteen. So I have the fray, I can bring back a 10. Figuring this is where the pass is going to come. It does not. <clears throat> So I got two two boats and two uh, great swords coming through. She's two cards down, but she's up. Problem is that Corsair right now is dead. Just adding it up. Thinking, well, I'll just coral this. Maybe this will get the pass.
Igni, but I got the boat to res. I'm like, okay, well, this worked out pretty good. Get the boat. Look at that 12 line up right afterwards. <laughs> that was scary. Tide right here. I'm going all in here. All in. I said, well, let's see what we get with him. I was unsure. I'm like, well, let me, you know what? Just I'll, I'll just restore the two. Get another boat and get it in there somewhere. <laughs> so 75. Big boy Vincent comes down. I'm thinking, well, I could just play uh, Harold Hounsnout, and that takes it. Because I'll be up, I'll be up one card. Worked out. So I got one card left. She currently has nothing. And I should be able to res like a 14 strength uh, great sword. I'm thinking the only thing that could uh, save her is maybe. Uh, For era uh, Shawnee, it was scary though, DJ. But it whiffed. It gave me armor and a a knight. So we took that one. Tied up one to one. Not too bad. Game three. Calvate comes in. This hand didn't look too good here. I'm like, oh no. Double Corsair in hand. But it's not that bad because I'm thinking it's alchemy and the witchers are going to kill the boats anyways. It's a best of five too. So, I went to flip again. Calvate off the bat. Going for the buff Calvate. I'm like, alright, well... 
I'm just going to go for old geared. possibly try to buff old geared I'm thinking there might be an ox in this deck and I'm like well it's good I kept this stone Cynthia comes out I believe I play uh I believe I play wild boar. If not I play a boat. So I get some of the engine going, but I'm like, oh, it's gonna get killed by a Witcher. So we play the Corsair to bring it back. It's tied right now, though, which kind of sucks. Thinking, well, here comes the other Witcher. And I figure, well, I'll go with the Reconnaissance, I believe. Or the wild boar. Maybe the wild boar I go with to strengthen up old geared. Yeah. Sure enough, ox. <laughs> I'm like, all right, well. Maybe I can get the uh, Donner out of this. Hey, <laughs> we do. Unfortunately, there's nothing really to steal out of his graveyard, which sucks. So I'm still able to get the carryover. That one poor boat still in the graveyard. Get the pass. I'm like, okay, well. I'm thinking I should just play the. Play the great sword. Because I got Frey or uh, Sigdrifa in hand. Two Freyas, I think that's too many. Drop one. Did I drop reconnaissance? I gotta keep reconnaissance, I believe. I wanna get a yeah. I just keep it. Cause I need a way to get the uh, the boats back. So I'm hoping here for a boat. I end up getting the Corsair into the boat. I'm thinking, well, here comes another Witcher. own great sword I'm like oh boy it's gonna be engine versus engine here so I think I'm gonna go with the great sword out of hand I 
I got greedy here. I, I probably should have passed, but I was so worried about the Witchers. Taking out all my stuff in round two or three. Here comes the other one. I get it down. S starting to get some, some ping going here. Third Witcher. <laughs> I'm like, you got to be kidding me. All three of them are out, though. All three of them are out. This was super greedy, though. I went way too greedy on this. Cantarella comes in. into Letho, I'm like, well, Letho into Regis. And I, I thought about doing it. I was like, well, maybe I should just uh, eat it with old or with uh, Grimmest. Yeah, I thought about doing it. I'm like, ah... So I just pass. No, I keep going. This was this was where I lost right here. It just that was that was incorrect. So D-Bomb goes down to one. I should have passed here. I think I played this last card. I'm like, I, I, I freaked out. I had a oh shit moment. I should have just passed here. I don't think it would have mattered. Because I'm like, this is... Sixteen points. K here does it. Oh, the ale does it. Yeah, two points. I think I was toast anyways, but I shouldn't have played them other two cards. I should have just let it go and possibly get another engine. But uh, holding, she's she's holding K here for sure, and that's like a whole boatload of points and I have him and I'm like well it's not really going to matter the only thing really that might win it for me is maybe Royal Decree into him but it's a slave driver into another great sword oh ship Create a silver. 11 points. I wasn't sure what to put back in the deck. I thought, well, probably put the ales back, maybe. Uh, yeah, I just put the witchers back in. Probably should have put the ales back in. But Kahir's gonna do it for him. Well, I 
anything would have done it for him there. That was that. I just I played that game really bad, really bad. So it's two one her. Calvate and I play my Amir. And then look at this hand. <laughs> I mean, look at it. It's so sad. Like. <laughs> oh, so bad. Then I draw Roach. I'm like, oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. There was so many things I could have drew there, and I'm like, nope. I keep winning the flips, but man, I just... The draws are just really bad. So that one wasted right there, kind of. So I play a Slave Driver. I get a Witcher. I'm able to kill the Novice, which is nice. I'm thinking, okay, I can Novice next turn for an Ale. I do have Vilgaforts to kill slave drivers. I got black blood in there. Calve is probably a lot better than uh, Emir for this list, but I just like being able to pick up uh, slave drivers and whatnot. Slave driver gets stolen. I get another Witcher. Kill the eight. I'm at, I'm hanging. I'm hanging in there for how bad my hand is. Vesemir can pull the stone, which is nice. This was a good turn for her. I was like, well. See, this would have been such a great play here if I was I didn't have Roach in hand. I could play Triss, pull out Roach, and then get a an out a, a beer out of it, but Having Roach in hand was just like, ugh. So I play the ale and I'm hoping I don't hit the slave driver. <laughs> and I don't, which is cool. That would have been such a good play right there. I would have had an extra four points. I think this is where she plays Calve. And I'm thinking, well... This is another reason why I like Amir over Calve, because everybody's playing Mandrake right now. And if you play your leader, Calve, it's only five points. You Mandrake their leader, and they don't have. Okay, here's a dead card. So before uh, before it can get buffed up, I just take it out.
I'm not up, but if she draws a, a one point card, I have to play the ale because I would got to get Roach out of my hand, unfortunately. I mean, I have Cantarella in this deck, deck. <laughs> this uh, deck, uh, a Seer. It's like, look at these draws, man. I don't. I have yet to draw a Witcher. Those, all those Witchers were from. Uh, slave drivers from their deck. I'm like, this is this is bad. <laughs> like. I'm just looking at it like, what is this hand? What is this hand? I just pass. I mean, I, it's so bad. I'm just like, this is... I have to pass, and then I run the risk of drawing Roach again. It's like, oh, it's it's just so bad. So we're on even cards. I have a junk hand <laughs> with three units. I do have the reses, which is nice, but I don't have witchers. I can get them off of the slave drivers. This is a good pull for me. I drop the ale. Hoping for Kahir, I don't get Kahir. I'm pointing at it. I'm like, there is three Viper Witchers in this deck. Cantarella comes down. I'm like, oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. So I Slave Driver into Novice into Ale. Oh no, I go into Ointment. And I probably should have went into Ale. Because I forgot I only had two Viper Witchers. So I had to hit my slave driver. I should have used the ale there. So I got my board set up for for the ales, which isn't too bad. I'm up 20 points. And if she drew Kahir, it's a dead card. So I'm thinking this is a Witcher. It's not. So I'm still up, which is pretty great. Um, I figured I'd go with the Create here. I drew more in Tart, but that'll kill my graveyard. I just go with the... Uh, The Ekimara. <sighs> All right. So I'm thinking, well, do I draw the novice now or do I? Play Vesemir for the stone. I also have shrooms. So I can actually strengthen that Cantarella, which is pretty nice. That, uh... That novice is going to pull that anyways. 
There's a lock that doesn't really help. So I go for the res here. Get a slave driver. For the extra one point. I'm almost for sure going to get a slave driver. Because that pulls an ointment. So I can't pull the novice. And I just hit the seven I believe. Just to get max value. I need to Vesemir next and play the stone, I believe. There's the one point key here. That was huge. Yeah, I think I go for the stone just to make sure I get Roach out. So Roach comes down, I grab up the stone, and I'm able to get uh, Vanamar. I think I actually go for the weather. With all the cards in hand, I figured it was better. It was only going to be seven. I should be able to get some decent ticks off of it. Here comes Vesemir, or Vesemir. So that Witcher gets killed. I think I go for Vilgaforts now. Because I was worried about using Ale if it hits the 1. So I burn it. I draw Cantarella. So I counter her Cantarella with my Cantarella. I draw the Witcher. Which is pretty great. That thing's going to die. I can ping it down with uh, the Witcher. All the way down to three. The shroom comes down for her. I'm like, okay, well, I'll just hit the Witcher with uh, Cantarella. So that's going to start ticking, which is pretty great. D-bomb comes in, but for whatever reason, it doesn't strengthen it. I don't know. I don't know what happened there, but... I don't know if that was supposed to happen or or what. I don't think it would have mattered. I mean, I'm up by 46. Letho comes down. Play the slave driver. Play the witcher. Now, I think this is Regis, but I don't think it matters. Yeah, it doesn't matter. So we take that one. We go into game uh, five. 
All right, so last game. She's got uh, Dagon Deathwish versus my Amir. Once again, not very good draws. I do have the the Witchers in hand. And I thought, well, I should probably drop Mandrake since I got Stone in hand. I can have that on demand. Then I just... I think I stop, but I might keep going. I run the risk of drawing Roach here. So I don't think I do it. I do do it. Okay. So turn one, I lose the flip. And I'm hoping for an Arachaspore. I get it. I can also banish Erdal with the um, Mandrake, which is really nice. Triss can pull some good things as well. So I'm thinking, here comes the Dow. She just eats it. I'm like, okay. I should have put the put the Araka spore on the range draw that last turn so that I could have used ale. I play Triss. Hoping maybe Roach jumps on the melee row. He did not. <laughs> yeah, if I would have played the Spore there, I would have been in a lot better shape. In round one, those ones don't really matter. The Araka Spores. They hurt, but not as much. So I figured I'd just straight up Ale. Big boy Roach down there, sitting at 12, now 11. Hoping the stone can possibly pull a lock, ox. I'm thinking, oh god, if that's Scorch. <laughs> yeah, if that's Scorch, I'm in big trouble. It ends up being Last Witch. So we got double, uh, double rock of spores. Look at that igni. So I figured I should go. I, I should probably go novice. Because I should have the answers for the DAOs. The DAOs shouldn't be an issue. We just straight up ale. Big boy roach up to 15. Here comes the weather. Fog in the middle. Problem is right now my leader I don't have anything to pick up. I got all ales in the graveyard. And 
and I wanted to save the stone for possible locks. So a Dow does it right here. Cyclops comes down. I get hit pretty hard. My problem there was I couldn't use my leader that turn. Cancerella's alright. I think I just dropped the ointment. I got all the witchers. If he does pass, I just play a Witcher. So we're going in on even cards. We draw the ale, we kick it. So our hand's pretty good. This is. We, we straightened our hand out a little bit. Um, Would have been nice to draw like a seer or something to put, you know, roach back in the deck. So off the bat, I just play Cantarella. I'm like, well... Oh, no, that's right. I, re I res the uh, slave driver, pretty sure. We, yeah, we, we can't throw. Yeah. <laughs> so we're hoping to have last say. And here comes the Dow. I'm like, okay, Vesemir time. We just need to get rid of that. Let's just let's just banish it. It's no more. Okay. So we got rid of one of them. We got three witchers in hand. I'm thinking this is uh, Bruis to bring back two Arachospores. It is. <laughs> this is super painful. Um... I'm still thinking there's another Dow somewhere, so I don't want to waste my Witchers just yet. But I think I do. I think I play one. I don't, okay. I res the slave driver and I get my own Araka spore. Played it in the wrong spot again. I just want to make sure that I have answers for the Dows. I'm 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 focusing too much on the Dows. There's three Araka spores, the one I'm thinking I should Amir. I believe I just play the two. Oh, I play the stone. I'm looking for ox. I don't get it. I don't have any machines. That's not very good. And we get some crud draws here. 
he's an officer, not a soldier. I had to check. I'm like, oh, my God. I get a five-point spotter rip. <laughs> I'm like, nope. There's nothing revealed, so that wasn't no good. I pulled the slave driver back. I'm getting hit for two a turn. Since mine's answering back for one. Still waiting on that Dow. Keeping the spy might have been greedy. Going in on even cards against Deathwish. There's the other Dow. Instantly take it out. So there's no Dows, but I'm getting hit for three. Now, if there's Griffins in hand, I'm getting a hit for four a turn. So I thought, well, let's play our Slave Driver. Yeah, I figured, because I want to get... I want to get pings per turn too. I think I could have Slizard there too for a slave driver. Get an extra one point. So here I should have probably. I should have probably used the Witcher to kill one of these Araka spores. There's so many of them on the board right now, I don't think it mattered, but... I thought about using Vilgefortz, but if I drew Kahir, it's dead. So I go with the ointment. I go with the ointment. Resin novice. Res a witcher, and I should have hit an Araka spore for seven. I hit the wrong one. I hit the six <laughs> instead of the seven. Uh, it hits the one, which is pretty great. So I got hit again. I'm like, ah. It's looking rough right now. So I play the novice into the ale, and I'm hoping the leader doesn't get hit with it because I'm going to have to burn my leader, unfortunately. I'm like, just don't hit a mirror. Don't hit a mirror. It doesn't, which is cool. So we're going two for one. Slizard into an into a uh, Cyclops. I'm thinking, well. I'm just gonna hit the 10, 10 for 10. I gotta burn my leader. I'm hoping for Kahir. Wispus into a Barbagazi. I get hit for another four. 
Vilga Forts. I gotta cook my leader, unfortunately. I lose three points there. So I'm hoping for Kahir. I don't get Kahir. I get Black Blood. <laughs> um, there's nothing that's gonna save me there. It's only 14 points. Um, so I have to pick the create part of it. I think if I would have gotten, uh, uh, more in tart, I might have been okay. But we lose by 19. Good game by her. Well played. Um, she wins three to two. Um, I just got overwhelmed there the last game. I was I I did get rid of the Dows, but it it just wasn't uh, it wasn't in the cards. I'm able to come back in two weeks uh, if uh, if no one else steps up uh, to play. Um, me and her are currently tied for first, so I'm not totally out of it. <laughs> we both have one win. Um, but that's the video for today, guys. Sorry it's so long. Uh, these tournament games take a minute. But uh, like always, thank you. Thank you for watching. Definitely check out a, a Shizzle. She's always on. Like She usually comes on like around like 3 o'clock, I think, Eastern time. Um, great streamer. Just an all-around cool person. So definitely check her out as well. She'll be playing... I'm not sure if she plays next next week in the tournament, but uh, good luck to her the rest of the way. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you next time.